Welcome to Exhibitor Lounge, sponsored by ExhibitEdge.com. I'm your host and your trade show mixologist, Michael Gray. Here each week, you receive simple, practical, and proven tips to improve your trade show strategy, get better results, and maximize your budget. Now today, let's look at the other companies that directly support you, the exhibitor at trade shows. The show service manual refers to these companies as non-official contractors. Now these companies are given the name of non-official contractor since they are not endorsed directly by the association or the show's general contractor. And they are brought in by the individual exhibitor to service their exhibit on site. To help explain the distinction, only official contractors are listed in the show service manual to provide services including drayage, labor, electrical, and much more. Now, as we talked about earlier, some services are exclusive to the general contractor, like drayage and hanging signs. And some services are not exclusive and can be provided by the non-official contractor. While in more specific terms, non-official contractors are referred to as display houses and installation and dismantle labor companies. All right, today we'll look at display houses, also known as exhibit companies. A more descriptive term applied to some of these display houses is the full service display house. All right, so what does that mean? Well, the full service title is given to a company that provides all the services necessary to design, produce, and manage trade show exhibits for their clients. Now our sponsor, Exhibit Edge, is a full service display house. All right, now a full service display house facility is usually dedicated to graphic and exhibit design and production, custom fabrication, storage, and preparation of exhibit properties. Oh, and the administration of all logistics and show floor services. Basically, everything an exhibitor needs to design and build an exhibit and get it in and out of trade shows. Now, the full service title is earned as a display house provides these core services in-house. Many companies can provide some storage, administrative, and labor services, but they do not have the core graphic and fabrication capabilities in-house. Now, they can be called a display house as they provide storage to house displays, but it would be a stretch to refer to them as a full service display house. An important tip to remember is that the more services a display house can provide in-house, the better equipped they are to handle all your needs quickly with what should be more cost-effective direct pricing. Now, the show must go on and knowing your full service display house can provide last minute graphics and handle emergency repairs can make all the difference to the corporate exhibit manager. So the next time you are looking for help from a display house, ask the right questions to make sure they are a full service company. All right, let's give you some of these questions. Here's what I would ask. All right, one, do they provide exhibit and graphic design in-house? Two, do they have proper climate controlled storage? Three, do they have tractor trailer height loading docks? Four, do they produce graphics in house? Five, um, do they fabricate custom exhibits and components in house? Six, do they have online inventory capabilities? Um, seven, do they have exhibit rental properties? Eight, what methods and procedures are in place for trade show execution? Nine, how many people are assigned to my account and what do they do? 10, where will my exhibit properties be stored? 11, do they have a fee schedule that shows in-house services versus third-party services? 12, do they have contracts with unions or do they use an installation and dismantle contractor? 13, if they do have union contracts, what cities do they support with direct union labor? 14, what exhibit manufacturing brands do they support and service? Well, you get the idea. 
Anyways, next week we're going to look at installation and dismantle companies and how they operate. As always, please respond with your questions and comments and let others know about ExhibitorLounge.com. Hey, we'll see you next week. Until then, I'm your host, Michael Gray, telling you, come on, let's relax in the Exhibitor Lounge.